Hey guys, welcome back. So last class we learned how to draw advanced stick figures and now we wanna turn them into real life figures um, or real figures. So remember when we draw a stick figure and I'm gonna do two of these, uh, we start with the head, we add the spine and that's where we get to have a little fun. So I'm gonna do a frontal and I'm gonna do one from the side. So a frontal person, we have our shoulders and we'll just have a very generic pose, arm up. Ooh, maybe we'll have two arms up like they're celebrating something. We have their hips. We have legs coming down. That one's a little bent, foot in the front. Maybe this one is just kind of flat. So now we have our basic stick figure. To start adding to this, this is our bones. We want to add our muscle. So we have our neck that comes down to our shoulders, right? We have our waist that comes in and comes back out at the hips. So, so far, I'm just making lines to figure out where things are gonna go. Now, an easy way to do this is to use shapes. So look at how we have a triangle here, a triangle here, another one here, and another one there. And this is really great because if you think about it, our arms are thicker at the shoulders and smaller right before the elbow, thicker at the forearm and smaller at the wrist. So now that I have my shoulders, I can follow these lines to give me an idea. Now remember, all these shapes are not perfect, but look at how this gave us the shape of an arm. Now I have that torso to the hip. Now again, I'm gonna do the shoulder to this arm, forearm to wrist, I'll get rid of some of that shape because I don't need all of it to my elbow and then the forearm to wrist. And just like that, we can do the hands also and making sure where our fingers come out, we can actually add our hands in there, which is good because your hand is about the size of your head. Now we can always go back and adjust things as needed. Now the same thing goes for your legs. We can do a triangle for the thigh, a triangle for the calf, a triangle for the thigh, and a triangle for the calf. Now this one, we might wanna change the foot a little bit since it's a little bit higher. And then we can actually follow through and do the same thing we did with the arms. So coming in for the knee, a little bit skinnier for the ankle. This is our thigh coming down to our knee, our shin in the front, and then we can have our calf. And then we can add in Again, what those feet look like. Now we don't necessarily want our person to stay just shapes or skin and bones. So we can go ahead and add clothing to them too. I can look at where things are going to end. Maybe this person has on skinny jeans, give them pockets, give them a seam if we need to. And you can always go in and add hair. So look at how just by adding our shapes and defining those, we can start to make our person look like a real life person. Now, if you wanna have a little bit more fun and pick a more complicated stick figure, we'll start with the head. We have our spine. We're gonna make this one. Ooh, our hips are gonna be a little short because we are gonna to be to the side. So we'll have our bent leg coming down our back leg kind of balancing. We'll have our little shoulders, arm coming up. Oh wait, have to do the position. It'll kind of come up and then out, and then we'll have our hand, and this arm will kind of come back and down. So look at how we have our points. We had to shorten them a little bit to where our joints move for our body. So we're actually gonna have our neck coming down. Our face is gonna be sideways. I'll just give some messy hair for there. And I'm gonna start before I do the arms, kind of figuring out that chest. So because we're to the side, it's gonna be a little bit of a square, which means we are gonna see some of a booty. And we're gonna have our arms. So this arm is in the front. So I'm gonna have to follow around where that shoulder would be. And again, I can do my shapes to figure out my size. 
So shoulder coming on down, getting that elbow, forearm, and hand. Now this arm is gonna go up, so I'm actually gonna draw in my triangles also, so I can follow where these shapes would go. My hand coming up, a little crazy. We're gonna pretend like they're basketball. Coming down to the side, that means this leg going back is also gonna be in the front. So I'm gonna follow, do my triangle shapes, follow the shape of the triangle, going back, that thigh coming down, that calf muscle, and then add in a foot. And this leg, because it's behind that one, we are not, oh, guys, a little ant. We are not actually gonna see all of it, so we'll have a little bit of that thigh to the knee, the leg coming down, so we can add in this calf muscle, thigh to calf, and then we can actually draw the foot. So notice you can do a frontal or a sideways position, but we always start with our stick figure, Then we add in our shapes, so our triangles. And then we want to round that out to be a person. I can't wait to see the five full figures that you bring to life in our warm up. Thank you guys.